Now I'm going to do an optimization guide for the Legion 5. Uh, these are the settings that I use. And these are the settings that have given me the best performance in every game I play. So if you come down here, go to the NVIDIA settings, go to control panel. And the adjusting me settings, make sure it's on performance. Click apply. Uh, with the minus 3D settings, just copy what I have here. Yeah, and everything else is basically the default but i'll just go through it in the adjust desktop color there is one uh, option you could change and that's the digital vibrance i recommend you go into your favorite game and uh, just tweak this and see like which what looks good for you um i have on 75 percent some people have on 60 some on 80 just uh, it just makes the game look better sometimes but just you know play around with it and yeah everything else is on default So yeah, let's just close out of that, come back here and go to GeForce Experience. Uh, make sure your drivers are up to date. Click on this cogwheel. Uh, make sure whisper mode is off and battery boost is off. And that's that for uh, GeForce Experience. Next, let's go to Lenovo Vantage. Um, make sure a hybrid mode is off. Uh, these other things, you know, personal preference. I have them off. Uh, make sure you're on performance mode. I don't have any overclock or anything. Uh, so another thing you can also do is go to power and put on conservation mode. Just caps your battery at sixty percent and just basically increase the lifespan. And yeah, apart from that, everything else is on the whatever the hell it was on when it came. Um, in system update, I am on the latest uh, BIOS. You know, some people with delayed BIOS have issues you, know, you can downgrade to 50 or 49, but for me, it's working fine. So, yeah, make sure these are off as well. Let's close out of that. Now go to Microsoft Store. You know, a lot of things actually update through the Microsoft Store for some reason. So go to your library and click get updates. As you can see, Lenovo Vantage actually updates through here as well. So just make sure like everything is always up to date. So that run. While it runs, um, go to your settings, like just type settings, go to your settings. And uh, in Windows 10, I uh, don't really know how you'll find these options. I think you could just type gaming or something. I don't know. I'll link my old video in the description, which have like uh, from this point on, it's literally the same. But yeah, this has an update, so just make sure that's updated though. Close out that. Go to gaming. Go to Xbox Game Bar, make sure that's off. Go back to gaming, click captures. Make sure this is off you know no point using this if you have geforce experience go back to gaming make sure game mode is on click on this graphics thing um i do recommend you put everything on high performance like you never know windows one day might bug out and put a game on you know power saving mode for some reason so yeah just click onto it click on options and you know put you know whichever game you play on high performance and then click on the change default graphic settings and make sure this is on. After that, go to Windows Update. Okay, I'm not going to do this update right now, but just make sure your device is up to date. Close that. <coughs> and uh, that's like literally, all, if that's all you could do. Now, one thing I recommend is you download 3D Mark Demo. And in there, there should be this benchmark called Time Spy. Do that benchmark. And you should get a score. If your score is below the average, that means you, you know, you have issue. It could be a uh, thermals, like you might be thermal throttling. It, it could be um, your RAM, right? If your CPU score is like nine thousand two hundred or something, right? That means you have slow RAM, and you need to get better RAM. So what I do recommend is you buy. You don't have to buy this brand particularly. This is just the brand that I use, but make sure you buy the correct RAM, and make sure it's either one RX eight or 2RX8 and yeah and that's literally like the one thing you could do that would give you a 10 to 20 percent boost to performance at 1080p so make sure you're playing at 1080p and make sure you have the slow run and yeah i'll link all of this in the description uh it will be an affiliate link so uh if you, i believe i'll get like a car wherever wherever you buy i don't know how much that car is to be honest so i just signed up for it like yesterday and yeah i hope this was helpful uh thanks for watching